What happens when we shift or scale our various input functions? Let's start with the unit step function, which we've already uh, plotted. It's just going to be equal to 1 for time greater than or equal to uh, 0. Uh, so I'll just label that right here. This is the unit step function. What happens if we evaluate 1 at time t minus 4? Well, the plot of that will look like this. The 4 it just gets subtracted off from t. So if it used to be that our function uh, underwent the step at time 0, now that's not going to occur until time 4. So if we label time 4, now the unit step function happens here. So this is 1 of t minus 4. And uh, essentially what that means is that if you evaluate f of t minus t0, the same as shifting f to the right by an amount t0. Okay, we've shifted the unit step function in this case by an amount 4. Now let's look at uh, what happens for uh, t uh, minus 3 times the unit step at t plus 2. Well, in this case, uh, we're actually going to shift to the left, so I should label minus 2 right here. And not only that, we've scaled our unit step function by minus 3. So our plot should look something like this. It's going to be a step to the value minus 3 uh, that occurs at time minus 2.